What up? What up? What the fuck is up, YouTube? It's your boy Stank coming at you with a long overdue garden update. Um, so sit back, relax, roll up what you got, pack up what you got, and uh, blaze up. Me, I <laughs> already have. Me and wife baked out the car this morning. Uh, just cause little Stank was watching Spider Man, so we went and baked out the car. Um, cucumbers are doing great now that she ain't spraying fucking salt water on them. <laughs> That's what she did to the last ones. There's a fly or something in that flat. Check that out. That's pretty cool. Um... Yellow cucumbers. There's one which I actually want to pick it now. It's about perfect pickling size, but nothing else is ready, so it'd be a waste. There's another one. My monster fucking tomato plants. I'd say every bit of 11 feet at least. Um. This is the one that's been cross pollinated. It's actually got, uh, sorry, but, and then there is brandy wine. Same fucking plant. Uh, another green zebra. Got a gang of tomatoes on her. Tomatoes all the way up, which is now, and here is, which is now what I think is a stable in the garden just because it's so fucking humongous. The pineapple sage, you can see that in there, the stalks are already starting to get woody. So, looks like he'll be here. <clears throat> um, we put up a lot of the Thai basil. Just because I've been giving it to some family and some friends and shit. But, I mean, she's still going strong. And where she's just dropped seeds, there's Thai basil <laughs> all over the place. In between the, more over there in between the uh, tomatoes. Fat brandy wine. Uh, I mean, there's even Thai basil way over here, you know. There's some right there. Uh, got some more cucumbers popping off here. Our okra. Which we've harvested about seven or eight pieces of it already. Um, mammoth sunflower. You know, the ones that get to like 12 feet. I mean, not 12 feet. Um, the heads get like two feet across. But what I'm happiest about is my uh, Thai chilies. They're finally starting to produce. Um, and that's actually, if you guys remember the runt plant, there's this one. Here's the runt. There's the big one. And then there's the other one. This is the other big one here. Um, and the runt is the one that's actually producing right now. So, um. Sweet 100 cherry tomato plant here. My green beans, which have actually pretty much stopped producing. There's a few beans down in there, but gave us plenty of beans, though. Um, I still see flower sites, so she'll still spit out a few more. Um, cantaloupe here. Turnip greens, which I'm just not even worried about. They're, uh, they're just there. Um, see our cantaloupes. Hop over in the garden real quick. Squash, which I told her not to put in the damn pots. Because they're not really doing anything. There's all kinds of gnats in that flower and shit. Let's hop over here. I don't remember what kind of tomato plant this was, but she's uh 
producing, finally. I just love that smell. Leave that lawnmower alone, boy. Look at him over here. With his Buzz Lightyear boots on. <laughs> I love that kid. Um, got more okra sprouting up. Yeah, we finally have peppers. Yeah. These big boys here. Yeah. Spitting out all kinds of tomatoes. And there's more coming in up there. Um, take you around front, show you what we got up there. We've actually got clones <laughs> of a couple of these uh tomato plants up front. Um, but be on the lookout for the indoor garden. I'm gonna do um some peppers. I'm gonna do banana peppers, bell peppers, and jalapenos. Uh, indoor. So I'll get that set up in a couple of weeks. Um, <laughs> pumpkin. She got. Bit of PM little pumpkins, but that one's almost ready. Put up a lot of marigolds. Still got those, but um, carrots are right here and there. Hey, Daddy, what happened to the barrel? What barrel? Um, we've got thyme, parsley, my wife drinks some parsley tea, um, whatever. And we got some chives. And here's the clones of, I think the bread, uh, the, uh, brandy wine. And then there's something under my porch. Hey, Daddy. hey buddy. Did you see where whatever it is under the porch? He dug up under your rock. What? Look. He dug another tunnel under your rock. Under your oh. rock? Yeah, where well, you blocked it off. Um, oh, and got some basil here that I finally took out of the container. You know, it comes with little seed packs and Comes and little stuff like this. So, there's a garden update. Um, new grill. Oh, and so we tell a little story. Um, buddy of mine. Okay, so I was cutting the grass a few days ago and uh, halfway done with the front and that happened fucking gas tank broke off so you know I hit my buddy up and mind you this is a buddy of mine that I went to high school with that I fucking used to pick on you know what I'm saying like I was a dick to this dude but you know we got older um, not cool and shit but he uh, does landscaping so he was like, hey, I'll be right there. He was going to come by and, and give me a cut. Well, he never could <clears throat> get out here. Um, but he pulled up on me the other day, hit me up, and I was like, yeah, I'm at home. And he actually, when we uh, cut that tree down, um, my son gave him a rock, <laughs> a big old he said it was his pet rock, and, well, he was coming to bring it back where he painted and stuff. But he said, uh, come on outside, man. I, I got a surprise for you, too. And he said, you see that one right there on the trailer? You see that yellow one there on the trailer? I was like, yeah, that's pretty cool. He was like, well, it's yours. And I was like, what? He was like, yeah, that's that's yours. Um, I said, how much are you? He said, man, it's yours, bro. And I was like, well, you know. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. Um. 
Thought it was pretty cool. You know what I'm saying? Um, so I put that motherfucker in yard sale and let it go for like five or ten dollars. Or fucking just give it away, pretty much. But, so yeah, I thought that was pretty cool. Um, yeah, there's a garden. This is some kind of pepper, but you can see the, there's more Thai basil right there behind it. More deal popping off. But yeah, guys, be on the lookout for that indoor garden, man. I'm going to set some shit up. Um, and we're going to do, like I said, banana peppers, bell peppers, and jalapenos. Um, probably do some serrano peppers, too. But the uh, banana peppers will be canned and pickled. And, oh, my God, I love them. But, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Your boy stank and I'm out. Hangover crew forever.